If you marry mami wata, if you marry mami wata, oh, 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 pa, 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 forever. <laughs> so guys, don't ever say that Jamie Aladi does not support the men. I'm already telling people, don't go and marry mami wata, oh. Don't marry mommy water if he carry you inside water. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Moving on to track four. Ugh. Are you ready for number four? This one's also a track that has been out already, has been released. Oh, I made a mistake. This one is by um it's called Lose My Mind and it features my friend um veggie dream we met um during a writing session in miami and we made great music we lost the data along the way somehow i don't know what happened but we were very stubborn about this trap we said no way we must how did you get to that data? yo i cannot tell you this is internal secret this is secret mm -hmm. this is cia stuff man i, I can't tell you Please. Alright, you're gonna this one here. Yeah, we're gonna have to you play and let's let let us hear Veggie Dreams part two, please. Yes, yes, yes. Got you. We'll do that. Alright, let's All go. Right.
Yo, I don't know what fish Pataranki was talking about. He, he said, buy you better fish where they sell for a papa. I never chopped fish on a papa before. He said, go your body bad, tear my bada. I'm all that kind of bodies, not my own, no. <laughs> Yo, and... So you know, Pato and I were, were coaches on The Voice Nigeria, um, season two, um, which is like two years ago, and we've just remained very cool friends since then. I go to the studio, we talk about family, you know, like we we rub minds on a lot of issues, and we've always wanted to work on something eventually, but our schedules never permitted it until you know 2020 happened and everything sort of like dialed down whole lot. We got the opportunity to finally put pen to paper and record this song. Like, it was as fast as Lord knows what, but it's been a long time coming. Thank you for love. Is it easy to do any work in this world? <laughs> it's 
not easy. I was just, I was just saying that it, it tends to, it, it's, it's almost like human nature for people to support, um, for people to support you when you are successful, when you have achieved something, rather than supporting you in the very beginning when you are yet to prove yourself. Even when you've proved yourself, they still want you to prove yourself a little more. I think people, a lot of, we have a lot of people deciding to be critics and nobody deciding to be the blesser. I think people should, should try to imbibe that, that culture, try and encourage people, you know. I think the more we encourage people, other people will begin to, the good seed of being a blesser would start to grow, rather than too many critics, man. If everybody's criticizing, then who's doing the work? Amazing. I right, two more. Okay, so following your success, would you be open to having some sort of mentoring academy for up and coming female artists, or are you doing this already? Brilliant. Well, in my own little way, I sort of am, but I would definitely be open to mentoring. Um, I believe that knowledge is I mean, better artists, shared, than especially female artists. Especially female artists, I would say. It's not going to be easy, but it's going to be worth it. Um, it's going to be rough. You're going to have to prove yourself over and over again, even when you have proof of the fact that you are valuable. Um, I think the most important thing that you have to start doing now is to ask yourself why you are doing this and who you're doing this for. And if the answer is you, yourself, and you majorly, then you're on the right path. Otherwise, you're going to be dissuaded. You're going to be pulled off track, you're going to be distracted and Lord knows where it will all end up. Yeah. Rodman asked, are you yes. still looking for your journey? Let's yeah. end it there. Are you still looking for your journey? We need to know. Me. Because Rod wants to chat to you, so we need to know Me. if you're still looking. Still yeah. looking for that person. Ah, no, 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 I don't want again. I don't want, I'm not looking again. <laughs> No, 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 I'm not looking at all. I'm looking the other way, literally. <laughs> and, um, finally, I'd like to leave the floor to you to share any thoughts you'd like with. There are media personalities here. Um, shout outs to the DJs, radio presenters, TV hosts, everybody that has taken their time out to, to listen to the music tonight, but more importantly, to support you all this work. What would you like to say to, to everybody here? I'm I'm really appreciative of you know um, my London my London people so to say um, I am thankful for the work that you put in every day because that helps to share the the spirit of music helps it you know distribute music around the world and I'm appreciative of the fact that you took out time I know you have work tomorrow but you decided to give me this you know this um, time. And I don't take it for granted. I could have been just here listening to this music alone, but you thought me worthy. And so I'm thankful. And when it's your turn to, to need something, I pray that God definitely brings a helper and someone with a listening ear. Amen. <laughs>